So hello everybody, it is Friday, so it's time for another DAX Fridays. And in today's DAX Fridays, I am going to give you a resource for finding all the DAX functions that are available and all the videos that I have made easily. Okay, that's the, that's the idea. So what I'm going to do is, um, what I've done is I created a Power BI report that actually goes and pulls data from the DAX guide, uh, the, the official DAX guide from Microsoft, and it goes and pulls data from my website. So you can grab all the functions that I have available in here. Grab them, grab the link, and I'll show you in another video how I did that. Um, but it's a wonderful resource. So this is this is how far we've gone. When there are 272 DAX functions, at least, that I found on their website. And I have made 130 only. I thought by now I would have done more than that. But, but hey, it's 140 videos, so I've done quite well anyhow. So here you can see the light blue are the ones that I've made for each category. The only one I have made completely is parent and child. And then I have uh, quite much work when it comes to time intelligence. I wouldn't believe that. Time intelligence, I haven't done that much. Math and trigonometry, either statistical. I've covered quite a few. Filters, almost all. I have some work, <laughs> some work left to do. So the idea with this is I've created these. Okay, and this is all the functions that are available. You can you can prefer just click on whatever it says. Oh, I'm looking for a statistical function. You go here and you click and you try to find here. You'll find the link to Microsoft Guide. And if there is a if that is a function that I have covering a DAX Fridays, you'll find it here. Now add columns. I have not add columns. Can you believe that? So add columns is not there. Haven't I done add columns? But here, for example, average is. So if you click in there, it'll take you to the glossary and directly to the function. So you can just go and see all the videos that I have made on that function. Instead of taking you to the YouTube video, because I have several videos um, for a specific function and I've done in the glossary, I pack them together. I take you to the glossary instead so you can see all the videos on that function. Uh, I'm just wondering, haven't I done add columns? A little lost track, but I haven't done add columns. That's, oh my god, I'll have to do that. Okay, but either way, let's go back to here. Uh, no, let's go back to here. So you can see here the link, you can see here my link, and then there is another link here. And here's the thing. This is a Microsoft forum that I have prepared for you to give me ideas on things that you would like me to do. Again, if you want to ha have support, go to the Parvia community. The purpose of this is not to give specific support on a specific item. It's more general things. So, hey Ruth, could you cover add columns function? So you go here and say, what video would you like me to do? DAX, what is it? please cover add columns. It's missing, for example, and then here, if you think, I, oh, I have a very cool solution that I did for a customer or for my company, contact me because there's no possibility to send files here. So you leave your email here. And if you want me to mention you as the idea, the person that gave me the idea, just put your name here and I'll see it in the video. You can put your Twitter handle also, whatever social media you have that you would like me to mention. And then you click submit and I'll get it. Okay. So that's the idea. So I I have like more than half. <laughs> no, I have like half, half of the videos to do. So how about I focus on the ones that you want me to do and the ones that time allows for me to do also. So, hmm. so here I have um, the list. This, this file is available for you to download. I'm going to show you that. And this is a list for me to see the missing video. So this is my internal file. And this is, so, you know, when I'm going to do a DAX Friday's video, I can go here and say, okay, which ones haven't I done? And it's easier for me to do them. And then I have here just, you know, to see how well I'm doing or how bad I'm doing. 
So if Microsoft adds a new function, it will show up here. It will refresh and it will show. Again, it's a live connection, so it will show. You can download these at uh, community downloads. No, sorry, at curva.com, uh, download center, DAX Fridays. This is a number that is going to be 140, I think. So you can download it there. I have posted it also on the community. This is all DAX functions and corresponding DAX Fridays. And you have the download file in there too. So you can just go and grab it there also if you want to. Okay. So I'm actually going to show you something cool that you can do with it. If you go to Teams, um, I have a channel for, for my YouTube and I have published, you know, download the publish it to Power BI service and then you have the possibility to tab it here. I've got this idea from one of you. I'll show you later on, hopefully. So you can go here to Power BI and then it will connect to your Power BI tenant and then I'll have it somewhere in here. Social report, no. Social media, I think it is. And then it is here. You click there, you save, and then it will embed it here. So if you have a channel where you share DAX tips with others, you can publish this. You can also embed entire glossary. So if you like, you can just go in here and then choose a web website. And then you paste here the blog glossary. So you can have direct access to the glossary in Teams. Cool, huh? Obviously it will take you out, but anyway, you have like a direct link to your your environment so you don't have to like Google it all the time. So hopefully this is useful. The, the one that you're going to get is just like this because I don't think you need to know how many of the Dax Fridays I'm missing. That's a list for me. And then you, if you want to, you are going to get everything. So you can just go and create your own uh, or add and remove to this file. So I hope that this is useful and uh, this is over today. I will see you again on Monday with another Power BI video, Power Query video, probably. Yes, I'll show you. Maybe I've already shown you how to do this. We'll see how when I publish this. Okay, take care. Have a great weekend and I'll see you on Monday. Bye-bye.